Hello, welcome to this week's uh, mini workout. We are going to uh, add in some weights, but not too much. And we're gonna start in a tabletop. So, wrists under your shoulders, fingers spread wide, knees in line with your hips. If your hands hurt, if your wrists hurt, move them forward a little bit. Always good, otherwise keep them under your shoulders. So here we're gonna do a little double action kick with our leg. So starting with the left leg, kick it out straight, holding in that, that abdominal muscle, and then dip it and bend it in like a donkey kick. Straight leg out, dip it and bend. So we're going up, dip and bend. Out. And then for seven, six, five. Don't let that lower back sink. Three, two, last one. Knee comes in. Check in with your body. Equal weight. In both knees, both hands, we move on to the right side. So we're kicking it out, even those abs engage, dipping, lifting, and bending it down. Kicking up, dip, and bend. Four, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Two. Last one. Bring it in. Check in. Even weight in your body. Now take that left leg again. Out. Lift it. Bring it all the way up to the side. Now here we're going to do little pulses up for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, two and one, keep your that leg there, grab on the other side, so we're actually gonna come in to a side plank, but on our knees. So lift that leg up, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Back on all fours, leg stays out. We're gonna do a little rainbow action here. So leg comes up the side, and over all the way behind you, back to the other side. For nine, eight, seven. Keep those abs pulled in and up. Six, five, four, three, two. Last one. Bring it out and bend that leg in. So we're going to the right side, legs comes out, bring it all the way up to the right side, and little pulses up for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Come over to that side plank and pulse that leg up for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Move through the center. Legs come out to the side, rainbow arc all the way behind your butt. Don't let that lower back dip. Abs engaged. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and last one. Knee comes in. Readjust yourself, maybe move your hands forward a little bit, and then tuck your toes and come up to your tippy toes with the knees hugging. So here, starting with the left leg, keeping it bent, bring that toe up to the ceiling, and down, up, and down. Long back, abs engaged, six, five, Four, three, two, and one. Put 
that foot down. Little dips here. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Move over to the right side. Take it out. And out. Up. And on for 8. 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Put that foot down, little dips. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Put the knees down. Gently put back into child's pose. Knee your spine up to see that. Just gonna come onto the mat for a second. Do some bridges, so palms pressing into the mat, triceps pressing into the mat, fingertips reaching towards your toes. Let's move those heels a little bit closer to the right. Now inhale. On the exhale, tilt that pelvis, lift your butt, lower back, middle back, upper back. So in that nice line, keeping those hips up, keeping them square, facing the ceiling. So here, we're going to squeeze those glutes together for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, two and one stay up high keep those inner thighs squeezing and then come up to your tippy toes same thing here squeeze those thighs together squeeze the glutes for ten nine eight seven six five four three two and one stay high now bring that right leg into tabletop so here keeping this hip square pulse your hips up towards the ceiling for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Stay high. Now we're going to dip the butt, keeping that leg in that tabletop. Butt dips and lifts. Dip and lift. Really rolling through that spine for 6, 5, 4, 3, two and one stay high put that foot down and little pulses up again for ten nine eight seven six five four three two and one stay high left leg lifts into tabletop little pulses up for ten nine eight seven six five four Three, two, and one. Dip that butt down for ten. Nine, eight. Keep the hips square. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Stay high. Put the foot down. Last squeeze here for ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. And one. Stay up here. Staying on our tippy toes. We're going to do a pendulum move from side to side. So we're letting the knees come over to the right side. As soon as you feel like you're losing control or you're about to drop them, then use those obliques to bring them back to center. Floating over to the other side. Right at the tip, bring them back. You're feeling your oblique really controlling this move. Nice and slow. Don't let them fall to the side. Go slow and bring them back up. We got five, four, three, two, and one. Knees together. Let those knees float out. So they're in sort of a clam formation. Then squeeze your inner thighs, squeeze your glutes, engage your lower arms, press them back together. Floating up, pressing in for 10, 9, 
eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and last one. Slowly, bone by bone, roll all the way down. Put your heels down, let your spine adjust, and then bring one leg at a time into tabletop, right leg, left leg, hand over hand. And again, if you have any neck issues, just keep your head down. You can still make a little cushion, but keep your head down. Otherwise, we're gonna inhale. On the exhale, deepen those abs, head, neck, shoulder, lift. Right leg stretches out, dips almost down into the mat, a couple inches on the mat, bring it back up. Switch legs, bring it back up. See if you can reach your upper body up a little more. So we're dipping, coming back to tabletop. For eight, eight, seven, seven, elbows wide, six, six, five, five, four, four, three, Three, two, two, and last one on this side, last on the other side, back to tabletop, extend that right leg down again to that hover, and then pulse that foot up towards the sky for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, bring it back to tabletop, extend the left leg, really press that lower back into the mat, don't let it lift, don't pulse for 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Bring it back into tabletop. Flex your feet. Elbow stays wide. Lift those heels a couple inches away from your butt and dip them all the way down into the mat. Bring them back up. Inner thigh squeezing. Lower back, lower abs working hard. Squeeze that lower back into the mat. tabletop and shoulder comes down squeeze your knees into your chest rock your head side to side plant your hands down again palms pressing into the mat triceps pressing into the mat legs comes up to the ceiling and from here bring them down to a high 45 extend them out a little bit and here we're going to draw individual circles with our legs. So they're circling in towards each other. So drawing in towards the middle of the body for 10, 9, 8. Again, the lower back is pressing into the mat. You feel how your abs are engaging as you press that lower back in. Keep it at that high 45 for 4, 3, 2, and 1. Let's reverse the circle. So moving from the inside out to the side. Feet are moving away from each other. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Put your feet together there at that high 45. Now lower them down towards the mat and extend them out to the side. Bring them back together up to the high 45. So we're lowering in between the high 45 and the mat, lower, legs come back to the side, bring it back together, and up for eight. Seven, press that lower back in. Five, four, three, two, and one. Legs comes together, reaching up towards the ceiling. Spread your arms to the side. We need a pendulum move, but with our legs straight. So again, really trying to keep both hips on the mat. 
We're working with our obliques. So let's move it over to the right. When you feel you're about to lose control, then engage the oblique and bring it up to center. Going over to the left. Abs working hard. Bring that oblique into action and up to center. So nice and slow for eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, last one. Bring it up to center. Reach your arms up towards your toes. Inhale. On the exhale, head, neck, shoulder lifts. Little pose yourself for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Head next shoulder comes down. Bring your knees into your chest. Draw little circles for yourself. Massaging that lower back. Revert to circle. 3, 2, and 1. Now grab hold behind your thighs and rock and roll yourself up to seated. Now we're gonna grab hold of our weights. So, legs are about hip width apart. Grab hold of those weights. The top of the foot is pressing into the mat. Get ready for some bicep curls. We got 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Now we're gonna take the full extension. So bend down, extend up. Bending and extending for 10, nine, eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Come up again. Now a little hammer, hammer curls. So palms facing each other. Arms come down. Bring your back up. Down and up for ten. Nine, eight, seven. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Let's add in those legs. So we're lowering and lifting. Lower and lifting. Squeeze those abs as you come up. For seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, come up, hold your weights by your chest, by your heart, and keeping that back long, squeezing in your butt, we're going to do a little, little lean back here, so keeping the body intact as it is now, just lean back, and bring it up, leaning back, engage those abs, and bring it up, so we got eight, Lots of resistance. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Come up. Bring those arms out to the side. Slight bend to the elbows. Shoulder stays down. Fingertips are going to reach towards each other for ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Let's see if we can do this with a bend. So arms comes out, bend as we lower, extend as we lift. For ten, nine, eight, seven, squeeze in those glutes, six, Five, keep those shoulders down. Four, 
three, two, and one. Come up, let your arms come down. Bring your knees a little bit closer together. Now here, we're gonna lean forward a little bit. Bend your elbows, they're gonna stay here. And then we're gonna reach them back towards the back of the room for 10. Nine, upper body stay still. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Keep those arms out. Squeeze them in towards each other a little bit and pulse them up to the ceiling for 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Bend them in. One more set. Extend out and then out and in. So squeeze those abdominal muscles. Squeeze the glutes. Engage the whole arm. You got five, four, three, two, and one. Hold it up. Little pulses up for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Arms comes down. Straighten the back and come down to seated position. Here, clasp your hands behind you. Push it down, push your shoulders down. Proud chest, long lower back and then extend them out towards the back wall and then lift them up. So shoulder stays down. Just feel that nice stretch. The side of your shoulders and your tricep, bicep. Hold it here. Should feel good. Slowly release them down. Arms comes to the side. Now let your head fall over to the left side. Pushing out of that right hand. Feeling the stretch in the neck here, all the way down to the shoulder. Hold it. And gently bring your head up to center. Other side. Gently, gently, gently. This ear just falls towards the shoulder. The left arm is pushing out. Really feeling the extension. Push the shoulder down. Center, 